Good morning! It's Melody Lane here. It's not morning. It's after 2 on Sunday. I really wanted to get this video done like yesterday. So I want to say, hey George, I am doing the challenge you challenged me. And I also have kind of like an announcement invitation. I'm going to tell you guys a taste test and a tiny haul. So let's get started. Lots of people on YouTube say, okay, let's get started. I never say that. I don't know why. Hey George, I have the challenge that you challenged me. I want you guys to know about my Crafters Confidential video I did with May May Made It. And we tagged some people and I tagged everybody. I tagged some people in the video and then I wanted everyone to do it who does crafting videos. And I will put a link to your video in the bottom of that video. And if you haven't seen that video, click here. And I'll put a link right around here and in the description below. You guys can always go in the description of the video and see all my links. I have links for lots of things. George did my Crafters Confidential. Well, George and Ken. Uh, they're Crafts by Two. And they started a YouTube channel, and it's kind of awesome. It's Crafts by Two at YouTube. They also have CraftsbyTwo.com. And I am so honored that I inspired them to make videos because their videos are wonderful. They're very entertaining and educational. And there are things you don't get from my channel because I'm learning from them. They do a lot of Inkscape tutorials on how to make SVGs to be cut out on the new Cricut Design Space. And they have some other videos too, and they're kind of awesome. So I want you guys to go to their channel or video. I'll put a link here and in the description. They did my tag video response to my Crafters Confidential video. If you guys haven't seen that, it's in the description below. In the end of the video, he did a challenge. I challenged George to do a taste test, and he challenged me back. And the challenge was to drink something I've never drank before, non-alcoholic, and he doesn't know how to have fun telling me not alcoholic, but no, you guys don't want to see me drunk. I have two drinks and I'm drunk, totally drunk. I cannot handle my liquor, but I don't feel I need it either, so I don't drink very much. He told me to do a taste test. So here it is. I was going to go to Big Lots and look for something, because they have a lot of different drinks. They have drinks, I think, from Mexico and stuff. I don't know. Those would be scary to drink because you're not even supposed to drink the water in Mexico. But I was at Kroger and I just happened to go along the healthy aisle. I was just cutting through <laughs> to get to the other aisles and I saw this. Now isn't that cute? This totally caught my eye. This was totally great marketing. And not only did I buy one for $1.99, this was not, it was on sale for $1.99. But look, this one is for the body. This one is for the brain. Isn't that awesome? It has electrolytes in it. This one for energy. But look at that. Drink water. Screaming, drink water. I just think that is so cute. Love it. Now this one for energy, it has oxygen in it. Can you read the label? It's so cute. It says, forget about the caffeine and sugar, ultra pure water and just enough oxygen to clean and feel your body craves. No nasty side effects like stinky breath or rotten teeth. Drink water, energy, and you might run faster. Is that so cute? I love it. Okay, now this one for the brain. I'm going to read this one too. It says your brain is 75% water, the heart is 75% water, your muscles are 75% water. Get the point? You're pretty much a swimming pool with legs. That's what the label says. So fill it up. Water body is pure spring water for optimal hydration. Drink it and feel super. That's what it says. Isn't that funny? Not for the brain. How about a bolt of brilliance, a rush of smartness? What a brain is purer than pure and just the right amount of electrolytes to spark the mind. I so need this. It's water on the high speed mission. Drink it and drink fast. It may just make you smarter. Isn't that cute? 
have you guys ever used these? Tell me in the comments. Okay, now I'm gonna taste them. I'm gonna taste all of them. Let's start with the pink one for body. There might have been more of these, I don't remember. I was gonna buy more of the brain because I think I need that. Okay, like all my taste tests, I smell it first. Guess what it smells like? Water? Nothing? Don't really smell anything. This is the body one. Doesn't have any extra stuff. It's actually good. Okay, now I'm gonna tell you guys a secret about myself. I don't like bottled water. I like tap water. I don't know why, I think tap water tastes better than bottled water. And if you've read or seen a lot of things on TV about the water, a lot of times the tap water is safer for you than bottled water, even though that's why people buy bottled water because they think it's safer than the tap water. I don't know. I like the taste of tap water and I don't like bottled water, I like this water. I don't know why. It tastes totally pure. It does not taste like bottled water to me that has like an aftertaste, I think. This, this is actually good. It, I don't think I can afford to keep buying this, but it's good. Okay, now, this is energy. This is vapor distilled water plus oxygen. Let's try this one. Don't smell nothing. Hmm. It tastes different. I think I like this one better. This one's for energy. This one tastes more like regular bottled water I don't like. It's still better though, I could drink it. It's not horrible, but you guys would probably love it. Okay, now the brain. Hmm. I think this one's okay. If it really made me smarter, it'd be the best drink ever. So we're gonna see if I get energy and I get smarter during this video. They all three taste a teeny bit different. I think this one tastes the best for me, but remember I like tap water. I like them all. And if that makes me smarter, I, I think I would pay the $2 a bottle for it. Gotta make me smarter. Okay. Now, do you guys remember I went to Cricut.com and did a huge sale? I got one of my things. Well, this wasn't really from the sale. It was, I used my 30% off. It's spring 30, and you got 30% off. So I used it to buy Divine Wedding. This is a Creative Memories cartridge, and they re-released them. Because Creative Memories went bankrupt. So now they can sell these and they're selling them for they were on sale for $29.99. And then I got 30% off that. So I got it for like 21 something. And then with shipping it was 24. And I bought this one because I love this font. Look at that font. It is so pretty. And that one too I like. It has all these other ones and it has some really nice things. No, I'm not getting married. I don't even know anyone getting married. But I really like these. I really like this cartridge, especially for $24. Yeah, love it. And I don't think I've shown these. I don't know. I've had these. I still haven't opened them. These I bought at Joann's for $20 each. I bought them because they're licensed. And you cannot buy them online as digital ones because they're licensed. So they're not in the subscription or anything for Cricut Design Space. So I went ahead and bought these. I haven't opened them yet. I don't know if I would ever use any of these characters. I like Mickey Mouse too, but I'm not huge into Mickey. I like SpongeBob better. I do have the SpongeBob cartridge and the Hello Kitty. I like them. I like Mickey too. Yes, until I need to use them. And I want to invite you guys to my birthday. It's 
starting Monday, 3.30 p.m. Central Time. My live hangout where I'm going to start opening up my cards and presents and draw a winner each day. Now, Tuesday through Friday, I think it's going to be 8 o'clock. Yeah, not totally sure about Friday. Friday's my birthday. Terry's taking me out to eat for my birthday. It's going to be 8 p.m. through the rest of the week. So hopefully some of you that work during the day can make it at 8 p.m. Central Time. And it'll be 3.30 p.m. Monday, tomorrow, could be today, or it could be yesterday, depending on when you're watching this video. I have a lot more hauls coming in. I don't think I'm going to do another video until I have another haul to show you because I'm getting a lot in the mail. And I'm going to be doing a video every single day, live, opening up my cards and stuff on my craft channel that is my other channel so if you guys i will put a link to my event in the description and if you guys want to be invited you can come in and chat live with me you can like type and chat live in the video and if you want need an invitation look me up on google plus on my other one not this channel my melody lane 815 and add me to a circle i'll add you back let me know if I think if you click on the link for my event, you can click on get an invitation or something. And then if I get an email saying you want an invitation, I'll invite you and that will bring you over. And let me know if you want to join in on more of my hangouts. I'll invite you. Do I seem smarter yet? I actually feel something going on in my brain. OK, I know you're laughing at me, but I don't know if it's a headache coming on. Like something like right back here. I don't know. I feel different. I think the water is working. I think I feel like I have a lot of energy too. How is that possible? I just took a few sips. That's weird. I never said I was normal. I have a lot to do. Wait a minute. I forgot something. I want to remind you that Tuesday is April Fool's Day. Okay? Remember that. Tuesday is April Fool's Day. For those of you in the other countries, I don't know if you celebrate, but it's like a prank day. It's a day you say things that aren't true, and you do pranks on people, and that type of thing. Happy April Fool's Day. Just be prepared. And I also wanted to tell you about a movie I saw last night, Noah. I thought I would like it. I really thought I would like it. I kind of like disaster movies there where there's flood, like I thought it was going to be a big flood, you know? But most of the movie was horrible. It had these big rock creatures that just didn't make any sense. Just nothing made sense in the movie. There was a lot of evil. There was a lot of war. And there's a motorcycle outside. It's nice and sunny today supposed to rain the next five days well anyway back to the movie I hated it there was lots of killing actually there was one part when it was just raining so people started running towards this arc which just was really not even an arc it was a huge rectangle of wood it wasn't even starting to flood yet and they're all running towards it and then these big rock creatures are killing everyone sorry if I'm spoiling the movie for you but it's really dumb and I love most movies. I like dumb movies. I like those stupid sci-fi movies that are really bad, like Sharknado. Yeah, I watched it. I saw a commercial for it and set my DVR right away because I didn't want to miss it. Yeah, it was a stupid movie too, but I liked it. <laughs> but this Noah movie, it actually made me sick to my stomach to see all these people being just slaughtered and murdered and stepped on. Yeah, that's how big the creatures were. They just stepped on them and just, just, it was horrible. I'm really disappointed in the movie. All right, back to the video. And I have craft video ready for Tuesday already and I have one ready for next Saturday. But I have a lot more crafts to make and a lot of more cards to make. Thank yous for you guys. And I have a lot of ideas for some really cool cards. So I'm going to get busy. i got to edit this video so you guys can watch it right away. And then I want to make some crafts. All right? I really love you guys. And I'll see you in my next video. Hopefully in my live hangout tomorrow. All right, guys. Bye.